So that was just a quick time lapse of me setting up uh, the camera for tomorrow's dive. Hopefully it will go really well. It sh should be a lot better visibility than last week. And uh, yeah, it should be good. I just gotta work out how to film on that camera now because I've never done that before. So yeah, we've set up the cameras the day before uh, and then they just get kept there overnight and then pick them up tomorrow and they'll be sent down in the minibus. Um, so they're ready for when we um, get to the dive site. Yeah, I'm just gonna stay on campus because I've got work later in about an hour or two. Which way am I gonna go? I'm gonna go straight up. Um, and I'm gonna get some work done. So I will probably see you tomorrow morning. The next day. I'm on my way to diving now. Uh, I've had a seminar this morning on the interviews. Been home, had a quick bite to eat. Picked up my stuff, put it in the bag. Ways are done, but I'm gonna get the train to the beach and then walk to the dive site. So I am now walking to the dive site from the train station. It's just down there behind me in that bit. Uh, it is such a nice day and I think this will be the last really good dive of the year um, because it is so clear. Oh this is going to be so much fun. Okay, so uh, I was going to do this video in one full thing, but it turns out it's quite long once I add the editing part. So that is going to be next week's episode. Um, so I hope you enjoyed this short little dive video of how I get my kit together um, and just some of the stuff that we see in the water here in Falmouth. I'll throw in some GoPro clips as well. So yeah, um, check out next week's video for a little editing tutorial. Uh, it's going to be mainly, well, not mainly, it will be all done on Lightroom. Um, I won't go into Photoshop because that's a whole new world. So, hope you enjoyed this dive video and I'll see you next week. <laughs>